And tonight, the Salt Lake City Council is looking at some tweaks to the downtown revitalization plan. The council wants to tweak some zoning rules to make it easier to build taller buildings and put up big signs downtown. Here's how some taxpayers are reacting to those changes tonight. A Bravena Hall is already allowed to have really large signs that advertise its own events, but with a new sign overlay, NHL sponsors like Mike's Jersey Subs or Jägermeister could be advertised on the side of a Bravena Hall. I wonder how often do we allow an entity to sidestep this critical process, much less an entertainment group with little history in real estate development? Smith Entertainment Group has um, said that they'll meet to update the organizations every six months. That suspiciously sounds to me like you're at you're not at the table you're at the kids table so discussion and public comment tonight the council has yet to take any action on those proposals